Thanks first for the invitation. I just want to say that uh, I will be expressing my own uh, view because I cannot talk on the behalf of, of the bank. So uh, let me just start a bit positive uh, uh, and uh, say that uh, over the past uh, couple of years, we have seen significant uh, world progress on, on human capital. And human capital, as you might be aware, is one of the new indicators that the World Bank is uh, uh, monitoring. And this has to do with uh, the, the knowledge, uh, skills, uh, and health that people are uh, investing in and accumulating during uh, their lives so that they can uh, be uh, uh, you know, uh, more uh, productive and, uh, 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 of course, uh, uh, contribute to the uh, society in general. So you can see in here uh, you know, indicators around poverty, uh, uh, adult uh, literacy rate, uh, infant mortality, and, and etc. They were uh, going uh, up and improving. However, uh, there came the the the, the COVID, and uh, as you mentioned, it, it put a lot of stress on all the systems, not just the, the water supply and sanitation uh, sector. Now, uh, our uh, assessment is that uh, both the natural and, and human capital will, will likely to, to be in decline. We have not done an extensive uh, uh, analysis, but we did a rapid one in, in Romania. As, uh, and as you can see in, in the graph, uh, unfortunately, but, but not uh, unexpectedly, the poorest uh, people are uh, affected the, the most uh, by the, 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 uh, the, the virus and uh, the, the overall uh, pandemic situation. And as a result, uh, the, the uh, economic implications. Now, even before the, the, the COVID uh, virus, uh, the, the water uh, in, in general uh, was uh, under you know, a crisis, I would put it this way, because uh, we have been talking this morning about uh, pollutants, uh, uh, droughts, uh, floods, and, and etc. So, climate change is, is actually, you know, affecting us much more earlier than than predicted. And and uh, of course, our water supply and sanitation sector is is not working in in, in isolation. So all these uh, extreme e events that we are witnessing and unfortunately about to be a witness more and more often are affecting the water supply and sanitation uh, sector. Now, five years ago, the, the World Bank has started to, to change in uh, its engagement, not only in, in Europe, but also across the, the world from uh, investing in, in infrastructure and helping clients uh, build such uh, infrastructure. We actually transitioned through uh, more work on, on capacity uh, building, uh, blending finance and, and leveraging uh, the World Bank money. And, and, and these days, uh, more and more, we are focused on uh, institutional changes, uh, reforms in water supply and sanitation uh, sectors. And, and uh, as you mentioned, trying to build uh, sustainability and, and resilience rather than then focusing on a specific issue or, or a specific need. Why is, is that? I, I think it's, it's, it's quite obvious to, to all of us, but, but even more now with the, the, the COVID situation that uh, you know, the pressure is not really that, that much on, on infrastructure, although uh, there is some innovations going on so that uh, uh, we can uh, capture the, 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 the virus and, and see in, uh, in the wastewater uh, and, and be able to, to react a bit earlier. But the pressure is much more on uh, actually the, the, the sectors, how they are uh, financed, uh, regulated, how the services are, are delivered. So all, all this pressure is, is, is telling us that uh, you know, unless you fix uh, the, the, the institutions, simply by, by fixing the, the, the pipes, you won't go, you know, much further and it won't be, uh, you know, helping on, on the long term. So we are uh, focused uh, uh, quite a lot these, these days on, on, on building uh, better uh, through uh, building uh, greener and uh, be a, a more environmental 
uh, in what we are uh, financing, uh, focusing on, on smaller and innovative uh, solutions rather than building like uh, in the past, a huge uh, uh, wastewater uh, treatment plant that uh, you know if, if not properly managed after a couple of years it's not providing the, the, the initially designed uh, result and then then developing uh, a resilient water uh, water uh, sectors uh, focusing on on the required reforms as, as I mentioned and, and providing uh, support to, to, to governments to, to address the, the climate uh, changes and finance, adaptation and, and mitigation uh, measures. But, but again, you know, uh, 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 through uh, 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 improving the, the governance, because uh, even if you have, uh, you know, uh, uh, significant investments in uh, the, the, the water sector uh, and in the water supply and sanitation sector, unless uh, you ensure a proper uh, uh, tariff mechanism, as, as mentioned before, a proper regulation as, as discussed in the second sec section, you know, we cannot ensure that, uh, you know, these uh, investments and the sector overall, as well as the, the services will be uh, sustainable. And uh, I, I just want to, to mention that uh, in Europe uh, these days, and uh, we have worked with uh, Maria in, in Romania, we're helping a couple of, of governments, uh, member states actually, to, to, to focus on uh, compliance uh, issues. In, in Romania, we have managed to, to help the, the government to create a new implementation plan for uh, the urban wastewater treatment uh, the directive. So this is something to be approved by the government and ensured, shared with, with the commission. We are also working um, to create uh, uh, river-based management plans and flood risk management plans. So we're uh, working uh, uh, and providing uh, advisory services. We're, we're not shining away from uh, infrastructure investments, but for, for example, if we are to finance in, in uh, uh, an infrastructure that the commission is, is not really financing, let's say a, a, a dam, we would not finance a, a, a just a dam here or, 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 or there, unless it, it cope with uh, uh, an improvement of the overall uh, management uh, of the water sector in this specific country, um, focused on integrated water resource uh, management, uh, and, and, and really, you know, uh, uh, guaranteeing that, that once it is created, there will be an agency or, or you know, somebody properly operating and maintaining this uh, uh, dam or whatever infrastructure it is so that uh, it's, it's provided the designed uh, outputs. 